Welcome to a video, and today our YouTube video is going to include my computer. Today we're going to be uh, going through whatever sites we want, and um, we're going to go through whatever sites we want, and we have to order from $10 and under to order like a make me kit, if that makes sense. So like mini, mini cakes, make a mini cake but it has to be under $10. We can go on Amazon, we can go on Wish, we can go on any account that we want. It just has to be under $10. We have a 15 minute like time limit to make it. So this is my part, so um, make sure to go watch Darby's part. And this video will take a little while because we have to wait for shipping and we have to both uh, uh, edit or post our videos at the same time. So I'm sorry if this video takes a little while, but let's get right into it. Okay, so here's my timer right here. I'm gonna press start. And then I get to go, and I already got the websites ready. And so here are the websites, and we're gonna press on Wish. And I'm gonna look up, and I'm not gonna, I'm gonna, I'm actually not gonna sign into Wish, so I'm probably not gonna use Wish, because it's gonna take too long. So I'll go straight to Target. And I'll look up mini. Oh, okay. I'll just look up. Um, how about um, yummy nummies? Have you guys ever heard of those? It's yummy nummies. And I'm not very good at typing, but. And by the way. None of these are sponsored, but it's okay because these are always fun to do. So I have, we have a ten, uh, $10 budget. So, and Yummy Nummies is not coming up on here, so maybe I'll go on Amazon and look up Yummy Nummies. And this game has a twist. We get to, we have to switch, um, we have to switch what we're making, so like, I'll take her, she, I'm gonna send her something and she's gonna send me something. So this is $13, this is too much. Um, so I'm gonna scroll down until I find one that is $10 or under. Oh, this one's $11, but we also have to make sure that shipping is not the same because it has to be $10 including shipping. Um, oh, here's a sushi kit. Um, I don't know if she'll like that because whatever we make, they pretty much have to eat it if it's an eating thing. If it's not, then you don't have to eat it, but yeah, here's an Orbeez Crush. I've already had this. It was fun and all, but it got boring after a while, so I'm not going to send her that. Um, here is an $8. There's only 12 left in stock, and it's free shipping, so that looks cool. I'll add that to my cart just in case. And I'll keep adding them to my cart, and then if I find more, then yeah. So I'm just going to keep ser searching until I find stuff, and I'll be back when I find a bunch of stuff. As you saw in that last clip, I was ordering. Um, did take me all of my time and me cutting it close. I'm right at the time limit. And I finally found my thing. It was, I found a um, DIY bath jelly pops. So I think it's something like you like can like scrub yourself with. I'm not sure, but I get to send that to her and then she has to do it. And then whatever she sends to me, I have to do that. Um, I did make up my own little tripod with a GoPro here. Uh, because I cannot use a GoPro, but it's okay because I made up my own tripod and yeah So now I'm just waiting on I need to have my mom sign in for all this. I did find a couple other things um, but They Oh, there's the timer, but they um, They did not it's like they're too expensive so I could not order them because I had two other options turned off. But as I was saying, I had two other options, but they were too expensive, so I didn't need them. Um, so yeah, 
I think I'm just gonna get the one thing. It's ten dollars. Uh, I don't think there's any shipping. I think it was free shipping. Yep, it's free shipping. So I'm gonna go have my mom um, right off on that now. And yeah. So see you guys in when after all that's done and when I get Darby's kit for me. Bye. Guys, um, so I'm in my parents' bedroom right now. And I just got Darby's package, and I'm about to open it. Um, so let's open up the package. There's a little tear right here. I think I can, yep, I can just it. Okay. So I'm gonna look at this. I'm not gonna look at it. Okay, this is what I got. Okay, I got a Galaxy Slime starter pack. So this is what I got. Um, and this is what I'm gonna be making. It's a little open, and there's glue. And I think it'll have instructions on it. And I've made slime before, so I know how to do this. But that's so cool because it comes with uh, the glue and a kid-friendly recipe, which is super easy. And it makes three batches of slime. That's a lot of slime. So, yeah. Um, so here are the recipe. Here's the recipe. And the recipe is... Um, Baking soda and contact solution. I don't have contact solution, but I do have um, I do have borax, and that's what I use. And I have a batch already made, so it's good that I have the glue and I have all the materials. So I'll be back, and I'm gonna bring all the materials. I brought all my stuff. I have a water bottle, and I've already made this because I've already made slime. So I have this. I have a pen just to mix with because I don't want to dirty any spoons, and I have my slime bowl. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with the first batch, and it says, put in this, put this in with this, and yeah. So I'm going to mix, I'm going to put this inside the bowl, put this inside my bowl. I'm gonna put this all inside my bowl, and I'm not gonna use all of it just yet because I don't. I want to see what this turns out like. Because sometimes I use hair gel just to make it feel a little bit better, but I don't know what the consistency will be different like with this. Um, so I'm gonna take my water bottle. I'm gonna mix up my solution. It's probably gonna be really strong, so I'm gonna take just a capful, nice little tiny capful right there, and I'm just gonna dump that in, and then I'm gonna mix that up. Yeah, so it's already turning to slime because this type of glue is a little bit different than um, normal, than just white glue and clear glue. Um, because I think it has to have like the glitter sticking somehow, so. Yeah, so it's already turning pretty much to slime right here. You see it's already like sticky. And so I'm gonna add a little bit more water to this. And I'm not even gonna add a full cap all the time because I don't want it to be like rubbery. So I'm just gonna mix that again. And then I think from here, I can go in with my hands. Oh, it's still really sticky. Uh-oh. So it's still really sticky, so now my hands are covered in it. But I have a lucky helper here that will help me. My, my other hands, so. can just do this very carefully. Also, this water bottle, I don't care if this water bottle gets dirty, but I'm just gonna literally put the smallest little dip of water in. I'm gonna lean that against there. That way I can mix it up again with my hand. And so this is a very messy pro process, but yeah. I love that it comes with glue and it comes with a recipe. Um, it is telling me to do this very slowly um, in the recipe. It did tell me to use contact solution and um, uh, uh, baking soda, but I don't have contact solution, so I am just going to use this. Mine a little bit more. Mix 
primera This is what it's turning out to be like. It's very goopy, slimy, and it's working. working a lot better than I expected it to um, because clear, clear glue is a little bit different than normal glue so I might have to add an extra ingredient and I'm just going to use a little bit of hair gel but I'm not sure yet so yeah it's turning really stretchy um, it is a little bit sticky, but I don't want to add too much borax water because then it will become too sticky. So I'm just now cleaning up the sides. It is still sticky, but it's okay because there's still borax water on the sides. By the way, my borax solution is about this much um, borax and then a full water bottle of water. And I just mix that together. And then I just let that sit and it lasts however long, add a little tiny splash more of borax water, just because it's a little sticky. So yeah, I'll be back when I make uh, two more of these. When I finished making all my slimes, I made the um, blue one here, it's very soft, smooth. Um, in it right now but this is the blue and then I have the uh, purple right here I did use hair gel for this you don't have to but it made it super super stretchy and like smooth and stuff and now I can make big bubbles and make this and then I also made a pink here the pinks a lot more and um, I did just use a little bit of glue. Um, I used pretty uh, about half the bottle. Um, about like I, can, I used all this right here, like up to right here, um, just enough for me to make these small little slimes. Um, and the next that way I could use it later. And the next step it says is to um, once all three slimes have been made have been created. Lay them on top of each other and twist and begin to twist them in. This will make a galaxy, I think, because the whole kit is a galaxy slime starter. So I'm going to take my slime here. I'm going to put it, I'm going to take all my slimes and I'm just going to put it on top. Um, and now I have all my slimes as like a sandwich and I'm just going to twist. And it kind of looks like a unicorn. Um, which is kind of cool. It's super beautiful. Um, it is a little rippy right now because it's just been made. That's a